We here at Ministry Box, we take pride in the fact that we try to always stay on the edge of video technology. We always want to tell incredible stories with the best tech that's out there and available. Trying to make stuff like this happen in the real world is always just difficult because you're always trying to find the perfect location and then deal with trying to get the crew in there. We just decided to build this kind of concrete jungle kind of vibe, very symmetrical shapes, so that we can get really interesting symmetrical light patterns. One, two, three, four, five. What I really like about the new GH5S is that it has dual native ISO. You have a clean image at two ISOs. We, we had so much light, so we dropped it down to the 400 ISO. But later in the day when we did just one single source light, we decided to go back up to the 2500 ISO and still get a great clean image. One of the interesting things about this new GH5S camera is its low light capabilities and the fact that it has 14 stops of dynamic range. You don't have to be afraid of contrast now. For most of the stuff that we're shooting today, we're shooting internal into the cards and we're shooting V-Log, 4K, 400 megabits per second, which allows us to have the most dynamic range possible. They've taken the flash port and converted that to a timecode input port, which is really cool because it allows us to timecode sync both of our cameras so that in post it goes pretty smooth. I'm personally really impressed with the camera. The fact that it has great dynamic range, better light sensitivity and high ISO, especially with their dual ISO settings. The quality of the V-Log as well as the encoding quality is just so great. I think it has a lot of potential, especially in the big cinema world as well as the indie documentary news gathering world. Panasonic.